Game two men told people they can't lose. They even let some people win prizes, but it was actually a game you couldn't win. Spend a little money, aim a laser pointer, hit a number, and win big money. Sounds like a pretty easy game, right? They were just taking money from people. Girard police arrested 40-year-old James Locke and 55-year-old Samuel Staffen on illegal gambling. One of the men had been doing this for nine years, but this time it was easy for police to sniff it out. Someone coming forward saying, hey, I believe this is a complete scam. Uh, and then we started connecting the dots and, and so it was pretty obvious. Detective Menenti says the two men would set up a trailer with a game and tell customers they couldn't lose. They had a board, uh, uh, like a, a board with levels with clothespins. On the back of the clothespins were numbered. Those numbers were used towards your score. This game board right here is the numbers that they use to see if you won or not. The only problem is you'll never win. You're talking thousands of dollars probably that, that were, were stolen from people, basically. The prize boxes were full of air, and for some people who played, oh, yeah, no. so were their wallets. So how can they get their money back? I don't know if there'll be any restitution involved or not. Depends where this case goes. Police tell me they are not sure how far these two men have traveled, but they do say there are more mobile gaming, gamble units out there. And if you see one, report it to police immediately. Live in the studio, Noah Daniels Wilder, WKBN 27 First News.